Hi, I'm Sharon with Lighthouse Communications. Facilitating a Q&A session is a challenge. You've just finished giving a presentation and your brain has worked really hard to remember all of your prepared content. But now you need to pivot and be ready to speak off the cuff with no idea of what's coming next. Oh. In this short video, we're going to share with you the top three Q&A challenges and their solutions. The first challenge is when the question is buried in a monologue. The person has been speaking for what feels like minutes. Stay focused, keep listening is what you're saying to yourself. I know there has to be a question in there, but what exactly is the question? The solution to this, paraphrase. Now, if you think that you know what the question is, paraphrase it and ask them. For example, you could say, I really wanna make sure I'm understanding your question correctly. So in a nutshell, what is your question? But if you're not sure what the question is, be direct and simply ask them to paraphrase it for you. For example, I think you're asking about streaming algorithms. Is that right? Be sure to say these kindly and empathetically. That brings us to another barrier. Challenge number two, when you don't understand the question. Maybe you're just tired and need to buy some time or maybe the person is speaking too quickly. Maybe they're just not being clear. The solution is to clarify the question. Here are some examples to help you clarify. Do you mind repeating the question for me? Could you give me an example? If I'm understanding you correctly, you're asking me about weight distributions. Is that correct? All of these phrases for clarifying can keep you from guessing what it is they actually want to know. But what happens if challenge three comes your way? You don't have the answer. Yeah, you understood the question, but you simply don't have an answer. Instead of saying, I don't know, and just trying to move on to the next question, there is a solution that will be much more satisfying for both you and your audience. That solution is to answer with what you do know. Try saying this. That's a great question. While I don't have specifics on that yet, what I can tell you at this point is... Pivot to something that's within your area of expertise, but is still related to their question. And then remember, you can always follow up with them afterward about their specific question once you know more. So there you have it. Three solutions to those top Q&A challenges. Paraphrasing, asking for clarification, and answering with what you do know. And like anything, the more that you practice saying these, the more comfortable it will become. If you have any additional tips on how you handle a Q&A session, please let us know in the comments. Thank you. Thanks for watching. Subscribe, like, leave comments and questions below. And if you're interested in a training, write info at lhctraining.com.